Hi there, Crafty Crafters. This is Pam, and I have my entry number nine uh, that was uh, in the process of being mailed, and I have one more, and then I will put all my journal pages together. So this was uh, entry number nine. Came all the way from Australia. Look how cute she decorated the box. And this is my second try of filming it because I accidentally showed her address. So I am filming it again. So. I just want to show you the journal first, and I'll show you, or the journal page first. Isn't it beautiful? Look at, she's got corrugated cardboard and some beautiful gems, and looks like a little burlap type in this fabric here. And this is a really nice textured paper, heavy duty with a nice texture, and this just gorgeous blue, I mean, birds and florals. So pretty. And then it looks like she had a stamp here, some birds here. And it's so funny because I have this paper too. So we have the same taste. And then you open this flap up and look how cute. You have you can put a little paper in here, right in there. And then that closes up. So precious. I love that. Little flap. Also, this opens up all the way. And here you have a tag here, and she's um, layered all these bits and pieces and decoupaged it and gems and um, cut, you know, used her pinking shears. That beautiful tag. And that goes right in there. And here another beautiful look look at that she decoupaged all this on with these beautiful gems and lace isn't that beautiful thank you and um, yeah this so this is from Char Fisher and she likes creating vintage shabby junk journals her favorite colors are pale pastels creams tea and avocado dyed papers and fabrics and laces she also enjoys mixed media and has tried most crafts. And look at this. So then this opens up and you have two more pockets. Pretty birds and this music paper. And look at this. Just beautiful. All these elements collaged. Beautiful, soft. Looks like she may have dyed it just a little bit. Seam binding. So pretty. Then this um, is that really nice paper that uh, is on the outside with a cut-out butterfly and some type of muslin type material she may have stamped on. And then you have all this writing paper. That's great. I love that. So beautiful. And then at the top, you have another tag. Nice sturdy tag with them. Um, looks like she gessoed it and stamped it and fussy cut the uh, moth out and stamped here and added some cheesecloth, another butterfly, and this trim here, like a crochet trim with a resin rose. And this is Ida Jane Designs, and her Etsy, Etsy shop is. I did Jane Designs. So check that out. Nice, nice. Love it all. So pretty. One more entry and then I will put them all together. Excited. And on this side, the pocket. More really beautiful decoupaging. Look how pretty that trim is there. And then you have this with a beautiful bird. And florals, real pretty soft seam binding. I love it. Just gorgeous, Char. It's really incredible. And then I think it goes like that, yes. And then, like I said, here's her information. Check it out. Check out her information or her store, Etsy store. That is so beautiful. And because I had given out your information, unfortunately, I did open it already, but look at 
all she had this package so nicely but look at the beautiful napkins isn't it gorgeous little vintage roses and birds and this napkin she sent all these extras beautiful roses another one like that and some really pretty purple it's a beautiful color two of those and then two of these so pretty. Can't wait for spring with all the flowers coming out. I did see a, bo a robin for the first time today. We still have, do have little patches of snow, and it's uh, maybe not quite 40 degrees here, but um, it's on its way. Those are just so pretty. And like I said, she had it wrapped real pretty with some ribbon and this packaging. And then she sent all these uh, little cards, journaling cards, be pretty for spring or summer. So much fun. Aren't they nice? So cute. Very cute. My granddaughter, who's 14, was here and she's working on a travel journal. So that's fun that she enjoys, uh, you know, crafting along with me. So pretty, thank you. And then she sent me this beautiful card. This, I don't know how it's made. It's, this is all cut out here. Isn't that pretty? And she says, Dear Pam, a big smiley hello from Australia. This is my page for your journal, and I look forward to following you on your journey making it. I endeavor to create a little bit of my style and a little bit of yours. I have included some little extras you may be able to use. Thank you for the challenge. Crafty hugs and blessings, Char. Pretty. So pretty. Thank you. And then she gave me all these die cuts of butterflies and flowers and, yeah, lots of stuff I can use. How pretty that is. I could do some um, collaging. Or add them to just about anything. So thank you, Char, for all of these. I love them. And then I have these really pretty extra cards, tags. They have little buttons here with some gauze and beautiful papers decoupage. So, so pretty. Thank you, Char. I really appreciate that. And everybody who participated in this challenge. Um, I already did... Um, choose the winner um, but I had you know put in Shars and then Pamela was the last one I'll be waiting for um, so but I do have another giveaway and that's um, on another video if you want to look that up because I'm giving away another journal but I just really appreciate all my subscribers you have a great afternoon thank you